Now we are seeing a muscle valve that dates back 200 million years. It is called a bivalve, that is because it has two valves, it has two separate As you know, muscles live underwater, attaching themselves to rocks. This attachment to rocks is a subject of biomimetics, for bivalves produce at comparable in strength to human-made glues in order to make this happen. Today, however, we will talk about paleontology. This fossil is 206 million years old birthed from today the island of Madagascar. This is a muscle 206 million years old, but by looking at it, you could assume that it belongs to a muscle of our day. As you see, there exists no difference between this fossil and the muscles of our day. It has two shells, just as the ones in our day. Its dimensions and shapes are also the same. Indeed, when looked at with an attentive eye, one can see that even the patterns are the same. As you know, muscles do not digest. They secrete an organic, inorganic substance called nacre, or more commonly, mother of pearl, on intruding objects and turn them into pearls. Muscles are also known by their trait of hosting pearls themselves. But the most important fact is that their dimensions, shells, and everything else about them are exactly the same as with muscles in our day. When we examine only the designs and dimensions of this muscle in my hand, it becomes clear that it has no difference whatsoever from the muscles of our day. That is to say, when we look at fossils, they make one fact very clear. Fossils document life in the past, and we see how Allah beings and what kind of lives they led. Because of the absence of any human beings and documents recorded at that time, we can only see these facts looking at these pieces of rock living beings. These recent findings of paleontology, we can go back 206 million years and compare them to the muscles of our day, and there is no difference. And therefore, there is no evolution.